What is up, you guys? Sage here, and yeah, we're having another fun one today. Um, this is Omoy. Omoy sold supplements in high school. Um, read 14 now, a business slash self improvement books, took action, started a personal training bed for personal training, went to coaching, coaching, discovered a love for business, and here we are today, furthering our knowledge and trying to share our journey as we, we further our own knowledge and trying to pass on the knowledge, you know. Um, but today, I want to talk about um, this is more fire, it's, it's by DJ Spoo, um, among other things. Just supporting local brands, supporting local businesses and the, the power and the value in it. Because the, the lasting effect of wealth, or when wealth lasts in a community, it's when it, it circulates in that community for a while first before it goes out. You know, um, that's what you'll find in the, in the Jewish communities. That's what you'll find in Muslim communities is that they will spend amongst their own people um, and then so the the money actually stays in that same place versus with typically with black people and black environments people are going to the money's going to come in and it's immediately going to go out right it's immediately going to go say i i get my money now i'm immediately going to go to my local whatever vendor my local should be whatever the case may be i spend the money then that person's going to pay their suppliers who are outside of the community, right? So, so the money doesn't get to circulate. Um, among other things, uh, the reason why that, the Mofire, the, the Knox as well, I want, I want to get Knox, um, is just we need to support, it's, it's getting into the habit of supporting local brands and local businesses, um, even when they're not so good. Um, I, just, I recently made a, oh, it's actually dropping tomorrow, a short uh, dropping about this tomorrow. But basically the idea is, these companies are not that good and it would be unfair to expect them to be it is up to us to support them give them back the criticism that and and the areas that we require them to improve in so that they can get better and they can improve and they can be worth more and sold for more and sold to other communities as well um exported to other countries and it is in that way that outside of you yourself going out, making a brand, forming a business and, and learning the things that you need to learn so that you can teach others. Uh, something else that you can do is to give to people who have already done this, people who are already pioneering in this direction and support them in whatever, in whatever way you can. That That's the only path that I see to, to liberation um, for ourselves. Um, the only way that we can emancipate ourselves from slavery from mental slavery from financial slavery is us supporting each other there are more of us than there are of them so if we come together then the power is ours that's just a core belief of mine so not to make today's video too long i just wanted to pop in and so, sort of push that that message of support local businesses you know support local brands um brother of mine has um a shoe store i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna plug all of these and i'm gonna i'm gonna put the pictures up as well brother of mine is pushing shoes um he has a shoe store on um another brother of mine has a clothing brand um he's pushing that obviously more fire knocks um i i, I do my personal training periodically but I'm, I'm very selective with who i train with and that type of stuff so i don't need to promote that right now but these are just examples of people who are on the ground right now today uh, trying to make that difference, trying to blaze those trails. And eventually, by supporting these people, we are putting them in positions to perhaps employ um, empl employ people who are in need, um, empower them, put them in those situations where they can actually get themselves in a better position as well. Because th that's the thing about lacking the basics is when you lack the basics all you can think about is where your next meal is going to come from where your next drink of water etc uh and what having some sort of financial cushion gives you is it gives you time to look further into the future um and obviously the more you have the further you can look 
So I believe that the first step to freeing ourselves as Africans, as South Africans, is allowing ourselves to have that cushion. And the way to form that cushion is by create is by learning so that we, we may one day create these big opportunities and we may employ other people so that we can create that financial cushion. Um, besides that, we can empower people who are already doing it and they are going to employ us and us through us working for them, we are also going to be able to, we're not only working for them so that their product can get better, but as their product is getting better, it's getting bought by more people. It's, it, it's, it's, a, it's a downstream effect that helps the South African economy in general. And through that, I believe that we are going to find ourselves and we're going to find what we need to find the people who have the ability, uh, the, the just the cognitive ability to formulate these ideas who are perhaps not in situations where they, they have food to eat today are going to be more likely to be in those situations. And that's going to downstream lead to them having these ideas, them being able to think of these, these business ideas, form these opportunities. And the, the more of us that we get on the side of being able to think comfortably, slow down and actually look at what's going on, the better it is going to be for South Africa as a whole. So in a nutshell, support local businesses, man. Uh, uh, thank you guys for watching. Love you guys. Appreciate you guys. Sage, signing out. Kiss me, you stay wet till I see. I'm doing good, I swear they envy me. I, this girl is in my memory. Oh, fuck, I get your friend like me. I, oh, no, I don't know. What's your friend? I made a listen from Morocco. I don't wish you living right free in my mind, man. This girl was a little pretty in the way that she was local. Kiss me, you stay wet till I see. I'm doing good, that's what I am